let's refresh. Get the video. What's up? Um, are you gonna leave the door open or close? I'm gonna leave it open and let that fan blow in because it's hot. All right, we have the chat. you take Cooper's warm hat and throw it on the stairs? What's up, little flip? Happy New Year. I'm going to start, I'm going to open this uh, Japanese triple starter deck first. I want to, I want to get these three cards out of here to grade. Dude, I'm excited. I haven't actually opened many cards for myself in quite a while, so put together a nice little package for today. I'm, then I'm going to open this premium collection afterwards. Pull the VMAX Char, such a nice card. Yeah, this VMAX Charizard is really cool. I think I might... This is pretty nice. I might keep this. So it shows on the back. So... So I know that there's one VMAX Charizard, two Venusaurs, two Blastoises, and then you get the V cards too, and then a play mat and some damage markers. But also, check it out. There's a Lugia and a Suicune. These are promo cards. Yeah, I think that these are promo cards. So I'm thinking I'm going to send those into grade too. What's up, Alec? Oh yeah. Okay. So the way I'm going to, I'm going to open this and then I'm going to open the sword and shield premium. And then we're going to be on to the mosaic. I got mosaic, not prism, but in my opinion, mosaic's better than prism. Um, looks wise. I've opened a ton of prism football lately on guys streams. All right. Let's see what we got here. Oh man. Look at this. Whoa. That is sweet. You got a Venusaur coin, a Charizard coin, a Blastoise coin, and then, oh my gosh, look how nice those look, Coop. Dad, that's a cool coin. Yeah. These coin I'm guessing that these coins are exclusive to this box. Those are awesome. Some don't bump the light. So, centering on that. Honestly, it looks pretty good. A little bit thin on the right, maybe, but that's... My plan is to send all these into grades. So I did my... I got my grading stuff uh, together yesterday, my spreadsheet. I'm at two... I'm at 222 cards. All my... My nephew's in here and all my kids are in here. Let's see. Okay, here's the promo cards. Some kind of weird divider in there. Dirty Mike on? Uh, Dirty Mike is not here yet. Mm. <laughs> you guys can't talk to me, Ted. So that's like a prom. That's the promo card pack. We're gonna open that too. What the heck is this? It's yeah. It's like a play mat. There's a play mat and damage counters and stuff. I'm not gonna open those. Can you grade, do you guys know, can you grade the coins? I feel like, I don't know, man. I might have to, I've got a lot of cool coins now. I've got those XY Evo coins. Hey, Laura, uh, happy new year. How are you? Um, it might be cool to make a display in my wood shop for all these different coins. I mean, those are really cool. All right, so we're going to open these three and we're going to open the promos. Let me know if you guys can hear all that background noise. We've got a bunch of people, uh, family members here today for the new year. 
and little kids running around. I feel like you can grade almost anything collectible. I Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. All right, so let's see. I need to angle this down just a little. That's better. All right, what's going to be the best way to open these things? There we go. So there's a whole deck in here. But I'm guessing that the only good card is the Charizard V Max, and then I think there's a Charizard V right behind it. Yep. Oh, two Charizard Vs. Let's go. Wow, that is a gorgeous card. This was well worth it. So I bought this whole box, I bought three of these. I got them for $63 delivered from Japan, and I think that that's a good price. Coop, get off the desk, please, because you're shaking the camera. Yeah, there you go. Thanks, bud. Oh, yeah, these are looking good. So I've got great. I already have the grading sleeves and everything ready for these. Yeah, I, <clears throat> I agree, Alec. I think this Zard graded has got to be worth 100 bucks. Um, cause you know, I think the only way to get this before they put this in the starter deck, this was a, this was a championship. Hey, Phil, what's up, Phil? Happy new year. What time is it over there? Probably seven o'clock. Okay. You guys still got a while till new year's. Um, so this was a championship, uh, trophy card. Happy new year, Phil. Hey, Coop says happy new year, Phil. Phil, we're opening a Japanese, um, Pokemon starter set right now, and then we're gonna go to some English. Um, we're gonna go to some English Pokemon, and then we're gonna do some sports cards. This this Charizard V is also awesome. This one, well, let's see. Do we want to? I guess I should look at it first. This one's definitely thin on the right. This one's definitely thin on the right. I don't know. What do you guys think? Are those worth sending? I mean, it's ever so slightly thin on the right. The cut on the top of this one, too, is... Th that's the problem I've noticed with these um, V cards with the black oh. trim. It's really easy to get some whitening from the cut. And I don't know if they count that against you or not. Here, look. Dad, See that? It looks great when you look at the card. But it, it is there. I don't know. I think that could still get a 10. Oh, maybe I'll send one. I'll just send one in. Phil said, Happy New Year, Coop. You can read the chat. Yeah, I read it. Oh, you don't have your computer on? No, I don't. All right, let's see if there's anything else good in here. I don't think there is. Nah, just a bunch of fire. So these are these are real Pokemon cards, though. They're not like um, you guys ever seen those championship deck cards. Yo, what's my? I'm not selling packs actually today, Jack. I'm I'll be selling packs again on Saturday. Uh, today I'm just opening cards for myself. Man, honestly, I don't care about these cards in the middle, so I'm just gonna cut this. Maybe. Oh, I'm an idiot. There's like a band around this. <laughs> All right. So there's like a pool band. Well, that makes it easier. All right. So there should be two VMAX Venusaurs. Yes. And then two Vs. So check that out. That's a, this is a good deal. So this one's definitely thin on the right. And this one's definitely thin on the right. That sucks. Blastoise looks real good though. That's, that's quite a bit thin on the right. What do you guys think? I don't know if that's worth sending. How's it look on the back? Well, it's not too bad on the back. 
left to right is thin on the back. Yeah, it's it kind of follows on the back. See, it's thinner over here, and over here it's thinner over here. It's definitely that way. It's thinner here than it is over here. I don't know. I'll take a look at those ones later. I don't want to sit here and stare at them forever on stream. These cards are, for Japanese cards, these are very thick. The foil cards. Yeah, I'm not sure. I mean, I guess if it's a nine, it's still, it's worth sending to me just to have one of each for the set. I do have two more of these boxes unopened, but I really did not want to open them. Really did not. I wanted to save them sealed. All right, this card, I really like this card. Look how cool that card looks. Centering wise, this one's very slightly shifted to the left. It's thin on this side, thicker on this side, but all in all, pretty good. These look really good. Oh, this one's this one's good too. It's this one might be ever so slightly better. Yeah, those are good. All right, let's send those in. I'll probably later I'll snag whatever the best Venusaur is and we'll send it. I don't think I'm gonna send. I'm only sending the Charizard V's too. I'm not gonna send the Blastoise and Venusaur V's. Just the V Maxes. Have you guys opened one of these uh, Sword and Shield Premium Collections yet? They look pretty cool. There's a lot of packs in them. I think there's 16 packs in it. All right, so those are all ready to grade. Let me sleeve these two. Squirtle's one of my favorite Pokemon, for sure. Don't think there's anything else in this worth it. Is it dreadnought? All so I not to open my Shining Fates when it come in Feb. Do you guys get them in Feb? Yeah, we get them mid-February, I think, Phil. I'm definitely, I mean, I ordered enough to open for sure. All right, and here go the promos. I'm kind of excited about these. The Lugia in here is awesome. It's the same Lugia artwork from the Vivid Voltage pre-release. And Suicune in Japan is a very popular Pokemon. Yeah, so these are these are promos. See that? 148 Sword and Shield promo. Suicune, and then look at that Lugia. Very cool. Very cool. Very good looking card. Oh, yeah, we like that. Let's get those in sleeves right away. I think I might actually... I think I'm just going to send the whole set. Why not? It's an extra 20 bucks. I'm definitely going to send the Suicune. Yeah, very cool. I think I'm just going to send this whole set. Oh, Kenny's here. I hear him. What's up, Kenny? Phil's on. All right. After this, we're going to get into opening some Pokemans, English Pokemans. Very cool. Yeah, if you guys don't haven't picked one of these up, I think this is going to be a cool uh, set to hold on to sealed for a bit. I mean, it's got all three starters in it. Like, how could you not... If they would have thrown a second Charizard in this box, oh my gosh, for 63 bucks, that would have been an unbelievable steal. So those Charizard decks, you used to be able to get them from Japan for about 25 bucks, the, just the Charizard starter deck. And um, now I think they're up to like 45, maybe 50. I don't know how much this set goes for. That card, th that look at this. Oh, you know what? I forgot to... Let's grab one of these now while we're at it. All right, I'm going to let you guys pick. What do you think, left or right? All 
I think the one on the right. Yeah, I agree. I think one on the right. All right, well, in um, two and a half years, I'll let you guys know what this graded. That Lugia is awesome. All right, cool. That's a nice little stack. Let's get the Japanese bulk off to the side. Those guys, but oh, did you guys see the backdrop? I've got, got these bad boys in now. I've got 12 of these ordered so far. I've got four of them in hand. I was considering maybe, I don't, I don't know how pe much people would be willing to pay for these, but considering maybe letting someone open one of them on stream, get the promo card. I would basically ship everything, ship the promo card, ship all the, um, all the cards and then all the contents of the box. Let me know if you guys are interested in that. I might put that I might put that up when I post tomorrow about the stream. What's up, Big Kenny? Peeps. Coop, can you not bump into everything? Oh, what'd you bring? I just bought a little blast. Little Blastoise box. You could have went card shopping at Stevie's Card Emporium. Yeah, no. No, too much of that. Um Kenny, will you shut that door since the kids are being loud? All right, here we go. Here we go. It's fine, Nick. Oh, man, look at this box. Kenny, you, you've opened one of these before, all right? Yeah. What's the right way to open it, like this, and then pull it towards yeah, you? Yeah, and there's like a little mat, yeah. Oh, dude, it's, it's got it's got like a gold aura that glows. Look at this box. You can feel the coins, dude. Oh my gosh. I think the coins are the coolest part of the box. Oh, here's our promos. Thin on the right. Not terrible though. And thin on the right. Isn't that what yours were, Kenny? Thin on the right? Yep. Mine were worse than that though. Yeah, these, oh, the back, I tell you what, the back of that looks really good. Those are going to get sent in. Don't you think even these in a nine is worth it? I mean, as a nine, what? Dude, those boxes are $130 right now. Yeah. Those are going to be worth, those parts okay. are going to be worth it. Okay, so we've got card sleeves. Oh, my gosh, can you imagine? We've got... Four vivid. Oh man, look at these coins. You're oh my gosh, these are heavy. Yeah. All right, I gotta make some type of cool display for coins. What are these little all oh, divider cards? So these boxes are meant to store cards. We've got four sword and shield base. Oh, this look at this one. It's not even in the pack. Oh, the pack's broken, that's why. Oh, hold on. Let's throw these in there. Okay, what do we got in the middle? A bunch more packs. So we've got four darkness. We've got four rebel clash. Oh, man. The dice are heavy, too. Oh, wait, these are damage dice. You got damage dice... Guys, the, this stuff, what's up, Kev? Happy New Year, Kev. This stuff is really heavy. Really nice. Wow. This is pretty high quality. So we've got, what, a booklet, trading card game rules. we got the player's guide for sword and shield. We've got a code card. Yeah, this just, like, talks about all the cards that have come out so far. And then do these come out or no? No. All right, so that's everything we want out of that. You would take the box. We're going to get these promos out. Uh, 
Oh, that's yours, Kenny. Yeah, make sure you take that with you. Beautiful card. So I've I've held both of these in Japanese. Actually, I have both of these in my grade pile for, well, I mean, you know, a little buzz, Kev. That's it. You know, we're going we're going a little soft tonight. Beautiful card. My guess is these will both come back nines. Kenny's just grabbing his cards from the stream the other day. Man, look at the gloss on these cards. Hey, Spirit Ninja, what's up? Look how glossy these are. You're back. Welcome back. So we're doing some uh, Pokemon right now, and then we're getting into some sports cards, Spirit Ninja. This is all for me. I'm opening my own stuff. Yes, very cool card. Very cool set right here. I would absolutely love in those four Sword and Shield packs to get one of the gold Zacian or Zamazenta cards. So we're going to open all these packs. Oh, yeah. You got some good ones. Uh, yeah, Kev, we're going to open these guys right after this. I'm trying to wait for my... Uh, we're going to open a react the Reactive Blue Mosaic Basketball, and I've got the whole... Cello box sealed of mosaic football. Dude, I ended up getting like seven Eastern cards last night. All right, so we're going to open all these packs. Let's do it. I'm trying to wait for my brother. He's still not here. Kenny, will you text Jeff? And I just called him. He is, said he's putting his stuff together, getting ready to leave. Okay, he was waiting on the mail because we got some, we got NBA hoops and NFL prism coming in the mail today. So he was going to bring that over too. Uh, so in this mosaic, your chase cards are going to be Zion and John Morant. Obviously, getting Lucas or LeBrons or stuff like that is still good, but those are the two best rookies in 2019-2020. The year before would be Luka. So 2018-2019 would be Luka. Yeah, Tyler Harris. There, I mean, there's a lot of good rookies. Last year's basketball rookie class was excellent. You've got Rui Hachimura. You've got... Um, yeah. What's the guy that plays for the Bulls? Is it Kobe White? Yeah. Kobe, Colby White. He's mm -hmm. he's good. Um, you know I you know what I haven't had luck with is pulling any LeBron cards. So I'm hoping to get some some LeBrons out of there. LeBron is still my favorite player. I grew up with him here. He uh, he's my age and he he grew up 20 minutes from me. I used to watch him play in high school. Guy was crazy. He used to sell out arenas in high school. Hey, do I curse? No, I don't curse. Uh, you're talking about on stream, I'm assuming. This is a, this is a kid-friendly stream. <laughs> yeah, because I curse in real life. Uh, I might be the yeah, Kenny will, Kenny will take it easy, he promises. All right, we're going to open the Vivid Last. Oh, yeah, don't go watch my old videos. And if you, if you can't listen to cursing, don't go watch my old videos. There's definitely going to be some cursing in those. All right, so we're going to open Vivid Last. Darkness second from last. We'll open Rebel Clash first. All right, here we go. Oh, way to start it. I guarantee you it's close to impossible. Code cards. Kenny's pulled three of them, though, but he's opening an ungodly amount of booster boxes. But he's, what are you, you're 50% below the average? Yeah, I've for how many booster, booster boxes? I've opened 20 booster boxes yeah. and I have three. Yeah, Kenny's opened 20 booster boxes and he's got three of them. I think that's pretty good. All right, so I don't even know what's good in this. The frost moth is what you're looking for. I'm looking for a gold frost moth. And there's a cool uh, I don't think Rebel Clash is ever going to go down as a good set.
Can you get anything in green? It's not even probably worth my time. I think Vivid Voltage is the only one that's worth your time for green. Yeah, these are the cards you donate to Goodwill. Actually, we go turn them into a local place here and get money for them. That's how I got my I hidden really fates. Oh, here we go. Wish I'd have saved all of my ball for hidden fates ETVs. Like me? Well, I've been able to get like 15 of them. Dude, that, yeah. They charged 130 for them, which is high, but when you're just trading in bulk for it, who cares? Yeah. Hey, that's oh, a pretty cool sweet one. card. Inteleon V. Look at the texture on that. I'll take it. See the the snipe shot one. Dude, that is that that might be worth grading. That's really sweet That's artwork. Card, yeah. All right, what do you guys think? Should I grade that? I'm I'm really liking that artwork. It's pretty good centering too. A little thin on this side, which translates to this side on the back. Kev says no, don't grade it. Yeah, it has a honeycomb, like, hollow pattern to it. Or texture. It's not even hollow. It's textured. And the honeycomb has lines textured in, like, all different directions. Very cool card. All right. Sword and Shield base. Looking for gold Zashin or gold Zamazenta. Who's Wawa? Who's Wawa? Wawa's Alec. I, I agree with you, man. I think that the Pikachu is undervalued, too, with how hard it is to pull. Which Pikachu? Oh, the rainbow? Absolutely. Absolutely. That's a phenomenal raw buy. For just gotta, sure. Just got to make sure. I mean, the nice thing is with those rainbow cards, it's the surface isn't as much of an issue as it was with, like, evolutions or, or a hollow card, you know? Yeah. So you're really just worrying about whitening and centering at that point. Easier to find a 10 out there. That's pretty cool artwork there on that slazzle. I just pulled a rainbow last night. Which one? The rainbow Pika? The Gons? The Gons? Welcome to the channel, too, by the way. Your name doesn't look familiar to me. Is this your first time here? Oh, yeah. I have three. All right, here we go. Yeah. Yeah, it's only 50. Buying raw cards on eBay is definitely a bit of a risk, but. Honestly, if you just ask for um, ask for more pictures, that's the way to do it. A quiet lurker. Do you sound like me? All right, come on. Give us something good here. I think we got a VMAX. Nope. Keldeo V. All right, and one more. Oh, didn't cut that one all the way. Oh, we got another white. Hopefully one of you guys is taking these code cards because I'm going to throw them out. Yeah. Everybody be careful. Everybody be careful. Coop's on my account. He's got band power. I'm going to knock the bulk over here. Yeah, let's get it. You know, Kev, I have opened <laughs> Kenny... How many of those? Uh, you got like five ETB or five booster boxes. No, no, sense. I didn't do five of darkness. I mean, I I, I bought you one, and then I bought three. I bought three more, so I did four. four. I've done four booster boxes of darkness of blaze. I've never hit the Charizard. That is bad luck. The Darkness of Blaze set's going to be good to hold on to sealed. I mean, anything with a Charizard in it always does well, and that one has Charizard on the actual artwork of the box. So it's a good hold, in my opinion. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I've got two cases as well, Alec. I'm holding on to mine. I'm not even opening them. You notice it's not one that I list for you guys to buy on stream. Crap. A big dark rye. 
Oh, we got another chance. We got another chance. This one's definitely not a regular hollow. I saw a little bit of something. A butterfree. Hey, that, the Butterfree? Mm -hmm. I got a Butterfree VMAX I'm sending in right now. All right, last one. The Mu V and the Butterfree V. Nope. Or like are my favorite cards from this set. It's just generating bulk over here. All right, Vivid Voltage. Oh yeah, anything that's a V card I sleeve for sure. I keep them in a binder. Uh, one of the Ultra Pro binders, the nice ones. Not the ones. I highly do not recommend binders with binder rings and plastic, um, plastic holders. Definitely go for those nice Ultra Pro ones that I think they hold like 480 in a in a binder. Charmander. We could get the reverse Charizard. Nah, Heroes Metal. Oh, oh that's a good hit. <laughs> yes. I'm, we are sending in two of these. Here goes a third. The gods forgot to say rainbow people. Let's go. I love this card. He's going in. He's getting graded. I've got two of these already, so we'll just adjust it up to three. Thick boy Pikachu. The one I really want is the full art Pikachu. I haven't gotten it yet. Uh-oh. Should have brought over my binder. Uh-oh. I got, I got like two, I think I have three of the Pikachu Vs as well. Oh, that's an awesome card. And a Pikachu, let's go. All right, we're hitting. We're hitting that one. So you get the Pikachu V, the Pikachu that, V Max. That Pikachu V is actually super clean. What comes after that? Uh, Pikachu Full Art and then Pikachu Secret Rare. So those are going to be our four packs. There you go. I'm going to sleeve up that Vaporeon. I, I collect Eevees and Eeveelutions. What, 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 what is a Full Art? So a Full Art is... I mean, a lot of people call these full arts. I call these uh, Vs or GX cards in the old sets. I call this a full art. See how it's a, a bigger image of the Pokemon, and he has, like, um, a different texture pattern to it with a, an outline. See how there's, like, a gray coloring outline around it? That's a full art versus just a normal V. you see what Coop put the answer to that question? Yeah. My Coop's a doofus. A type of Pokemon. <laughs> All right, can we go three for three? Whoa. Nah. Where did you get this? Uh, I got that for Coop, or Coop's grandma got that for Coop for his, was it your birthday or no? It was like, it was like Halloween. It was for Halloween. Nice. I love that card. We all do. Yeah, the full arts have different artwork than the regular V cards. Generally, the full art artwork is much more preferred. Yeah, it's textured. And it's definitely textured, yeah. Three out of four, white, for Vivid. That's pretty solid. They must have put all the good pulls in your box. Last pack magic, here we go. All right, I did not see it. I don't know what it is. Come on, reverse Charizard into Pikachu. Nope. And nope. Oh, we got the Snorlax. That's a good card. That's a real good pull there. Hollow Snorlax. Very, very happy with that. That's very well centered, too. Nice overall pulls. I agree. All right. Uh, there's your cards. You, were you going to open your box on stream? Is that why you brought it? 
I, I wasn't even planning on opening it. Oh, okay. Um, but I can't. I was going to say, well, if you want to, now would be the time to hop in and do it while we wait for Jeff for the sports cards. All right, so out of that box to grade, for sure, we've got these three cards. And then hits-wise, not too bad, honestly. Uh, you know, these. so I, if you're not into sports, these are good sports cards to watch still. They, um, these are worth quite a bit. Kenny's going to hop in and open a little bit more Pokemon, though. He's got a Blastoise GX box he want, he brought over to open. It's the only thing they had at Walmart. It was the only thing at Walmart. I, this is the last Pokemon. Oh, look what else I got. I got these bad boys left over from stream. There might Maybe there's a Pika in there. I was going to save those for you guys on Saturday, though, because we didn't pull anything crazy out of that. I think we got one Amazing Rare in all those packs. So there's got to still be something good in that box. So I was gonna I was gonna save that vivid voltage box for you guys for Saturday. Spirit, I know you missed it, but we opened this too before you came. We opened this uh, triple starter Japanese box. It's a beautiful collection of starter decks. Let me just show you those cards real quick because you probably missed them. Is that Jeff? What's up, Jeff? So all these cards came inside that box. And then there are four promos specific to only that box. So you've got the Lugia artwork from Vivid Voltage promo. You've got a Suicune. And then I'm not sure what these two are. And then also got VMAXs of Venusaur, Blastoise, Blastoise, Charizard, and then another Charizard V. So a pretty awesome stack of hit cards out of that starter deck box that I got from Japan delivered for 63 bucks. You have to look at those cards too, because those are actually good candidates for Beckett. If you like to get a black oh. label on those would be huge. My my Charizard was good, the rest of them weren't. Alright. So here's the code card for the premium collection. And then you got three promo, well, not really promos, but this is a promo right here. The Blastoise one, I like that a lot. And then these are like those, the weird hollows of Wartortle and Squirtle. Pretty cool. All right, first up, Rebel Clash. Yeah, Kev, if you were asking about the Japanese box, those are guaranteed hits. You, It's a predetermined starter deck, so you'll get all those exact same cards and promo cards if you get that box. Ooh, Ooh a nice cool art double. <laughs> Haven't seen that one before. Throw that there. All right, we got Sword and Shield. Sold over 18 or 800 code cards for 10 cents each. That's pretty good, dude. Heck, yeah. We go. Yo, oh, where's Mike? He's got to get in here for this mosaic. Uh, I, you know, I kind of forgot this was a white back. Another Rebel Clash. Bent code card like that. All right, now we got Unified Minds. Good card there. What's the hit card in here? Mew Mewtwo, I think? Mm -hmm. Well, the Mewtwo's in here. The that's, Mewtwo? Oh, no, that's Shining, that's Shining, Shining Legends. Legends. Yeah, Mew Mewtwo. Celebi and nothing. 
All right, Burning Shadows. Oh, is Alec in here? If Alec's in here, you're going to pull a Charizard out of Evo pack. Well, hopefully I pull a Charizard out of this pack. Nope. Here's your code card. Burning Shadows has not been good to me. Go through these. All right. Evolutions. Pikachu right off the bat. Oh, it's all right. Got the reverse coming. This Weedle looks so weird, the yeah, print. It almost looks fake. Yeah. Star you, drowsy. That drowsy. Well. It'd be cool if there was a non hollow Zard in that, too. Yeah. There's a couple things they could have done better with Evo to make that set one of the best of all time. They add in the Blastoise, they add in the Venusaur. Yeah, for sure. So, I think the coolest thing that I got out of this. This is the promo? That promo. I mean, look at that. Do you want to sleeve it? Sleeves are right here. Yeah, I'm going to sleeve them. I'll grab it. Just grab it and get it back on. And an Arcanine Hollow, yeah. All right, here we go. Let me get Kenny's trash out of here. I wasn't, I wasn't used to the trash being on the left. I know. You can just dump stuff right now, right in the trash. Reverse. All right, let me get the Pokemon out of the way because we're going to go on to the sports cards here. Yeah, it's so funny to get a freaking four double. Uh, Cooper got the shiny Star V double yeah, shiny. There, so, uh, it's pretty cool. All right, so these boxes we're going to open, the sports boxes, are pretty. So this box right now. I think this box is around 250 bucks for 80 cards. About four months ago, you could get it for 150 bucks, and the season started, so they've started going up. But if you haven't seen Mosaic sports cards, these are extremely beautiful for sports cards. They're very reflective, they're mirrored. And then this one's football. So we're gonna start with the basketball. Did you move my bag? Mm -mm. Oh, yeah, your bag of cards? I put it on the table there. Let's go, Kev. I want to get a LeBron in here for sure. Come on, there's got to be a LeBron. These are sweet packs. So there's eight cards in every pack. That's quite a few. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, I mean, I yelled up to him that I was opening these. No, I don't. I don't know who K Pack is. It's the first time I've ever opened this, so I'm just taking a look. So we're looking for Zion, we're looking for Ja, we're looking for LeBron. Are these guaranteed auto? Uh, I don't know. Reactive blue mosaic prisms, I know, are the big cards. Okay. All right, so we've got a Serge Ibaka, Cody Zeller. We're going to sleeve up all the rookies for sure. Hey, there's your boy, Gordon Hayward. Kenny's friends with Gordon Hayward. All right, we've got our reactive John Collins. We've got an old school Dennis Johnson, silver prism, it's like a stained glass effect in the background. That's sweet. We've got a USA basketball Kevin Durant. We've got a rookie Nicola Melli for the Pelicans. Oh, and a LeBron MVP. Let's go. I played against Nicola Melli in Germany. Did you? Play for that is a cool LeBron. And obviously he's wearing his Cavs stuff, which is even better for me because I'm, I'm a Cavs fan. All right, one pack in and we hit the LeBron. Let's go.
That's not the Bron I wanted, but I'll take it. Coop, let me see your LeBron. This this LeBron in a different reactive would be an awesome card to get. So this is the pink reactive. I think you can only get these in um, cello packs. Uh, you can mega, box, mega box exclusive pink, pink fluorescent mosaic prism. Pink fluorescent? Is that what it says? On the side. All right. Well, maybe I can get them in here. Just pulled a colossal gold. That's a cool card. All right. How hard are these to open? That's not too bad. Oh, we got a D Rose. Kind of weird seeing him wearing a Pistons uniform. Actually, here, let me... Uh, I'm going to tilt this camera up just a little bit. It's with the basketball cards. I'm holding them a little bit higher than the Pokemon. These ones are different. Like, they're so glossy, you want to kind of hold them around the edges. Ricky Rubio. Grayson Allen. Matisse Thibel. That's a good one. That's a good reactive rookie, for sure. Then we got a silver mosaic of Bryn Forbes with a bunch of glue. Look at all that glue on top. I think that just wipes off, but still kind of messy. L.A. Clippers rookie. How do you even say that? Mufuyandu. We got a Hall of Fame Carl Malone and a Jordan Poole rookie. All right, so no Ja, no Zion yet. Let's go. We need them. Out of 80 cards, we should have a decent shot of getting them. Oh, yes. Got the base LeBron. That is a sweet card. So is the Cavs one like an alternate? Yeah, the Cavs one because it's an MVP. Whenever, whatever year they, were, they won the MVP that the picture's from is what jer jersey they'll have on. So that's a sweet card. Got Dylan Brooks, Kevin Love, one of my favorite players of all time. That's a good hit. Karis Levert, Prism. A James Harden give and go. I think his yeah, I think his stock's going down. A Hall of Fame Charles Barkley. A nice base rookie Rui Hachimura. That's a good card. And our final card. NBA debut Zion. Let's go. That was a good pack. All right, hold on. I'm going to take a minute to sleeve these up. That was a really good pack. I, I saw your comment. I'll go back and read it, Spirit Ninja. You were telling me that guy basically, is that was a, a YouTuber. You can go on and guess a number, and he sends you free packs. These sleeves are a little tight. That's sweet. I think I have bigger ones. Hold on, let me try. I've got these Dave and Adams card sleeves too. These are these ones are ultra pros. Let me see if these are better. Yo, we hit the big guy. That's a good looking card too. I don't see any print lines on that. Oh yeah, that's definitely better. All right, we'll use these sleeves. Get these other ones out of here. Got our base LeBron. All right, I knew it was going to be fun opening these. I didn't know it was going to be this fun. So cute. <laughs> Let's see, what's our other best card so far? Dude, that Zion's real sweet. We want, we want to get the base rookie Zion. So probably, probably this Matisse Thibel at this point. Dude, a silver prism base Zion would be, that would be so good. All right, next pack. Oh, but it's more than that. If you win, he opens it, and you win, pay for it, and he sends you. 
That Zion was the last card in that pack, wasn't it? All right, Kevin Herter, Wesley Matthews, Davis Burtons, a Bam out of Bayou. That's a good one. Blue Mosaic. A Got Game Donovan Mitchell. Also a good one. A KZ. KZ. His name is KZ. Interesting. Acapala. Rookie. A Steph Curry USA. And a Taco Fall Rookie. Again, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep sleeving all the rookies here. Kev, your your favorite team is the Raptors. Who's the Who's the Raptors card you want in here? I will say these mosaic cards. I'm kind of surprised how dirty they are. They just look dirty. Like there's paper dust and glue stains and stuff. You got to actually clean them up before you send them in. I don't think so. A Siakam. All right, Julius Randle. This guy's a beast. Danny Green blowing the three-pointers. One in spite of him. Kenny, I got your boy, Daniel Thice. Daniel Tice. Kenny's played with him, too. All right, here we go. Let's get something good. A Scotty Pippen USA Mosaic. My brother will like that one. And we got a silver Aaron Baines. That's a, that's a crap one. I mean, he's a good player, but that's not what we want to waste our silver on. A Hall of Fame AI. Jalen Noel. And an NBA debut, Ty Jerome. Man, these there's a lot of cards. 80 cards is quite a bit when you think about it. Jared did. In which one? I have four boxes. He didn't tell me which one to open. Whatever one you pick. All right. How about a base jaw? That's what I really want. I've been looking at those on eBay, and they're at least twenty bucks. Nick, I'm here. Hit the base or hit the NBA debut Zion. You did. And two LeBrons so far. That's awesome. Yeah. Dirty Mike here yet? Dirty Mike is not in here. Yeah. Oh, Danny Green's on the Raptors now. That's funny. Hold on. I gotta... When did Danny Green go to the Raptors? Must have just went this year. Back for the Lakers. So this is the Sacramento Kings with a purple background, but they have on a blue, a blue uniform. Thomas Bryant. Firkin Corkmez. NBA debut, Jackson Hayes. So there's a that's a rookie mosaic. That's not bad, but, I mean, we're looking for a different Pelican. A give and go, Damian Lillard. A Brandon Clark base rookie. That's a good one. An NBA debut, Nicola Melli. And a PJ Washington. Man, that was loaded with rookies. Is it is it possible to just get like an all rookie pack, Kev? Do you know? That was a lot of rookies there. So if you guys aren't familiar with Mosaic, the, the NBA debuts are not worth as much as just the base rookie cards. So, like, this is a base rookie card. So see how it says RC for rookie card? So that and a Zion and Ja are the two best rookie cards just of the plain set. Then you can also get the special cards, which are like these guys right here. Where it has this blue, I think this is the reactive blue prism. Man, these cards are so thick. 
And they all have like a slight curve to them. What do I think of the delivery Pikachus long term? I think they're a phenomenal card to have. Phenomenal. I, I don't see those ever going down. Uh, all right, four packs left to get a John ja Morant. I think that's a great buy. Three for 150 I mean, at today's prices. All right, we got a Mellow. Miles Bridges. Steven Adams. A Stephen Curry Reactive Blue. That's a good hit. A J.J. Redick Silver Prism. I'm a big fan of J.J. Redick. An NBA debut, Jarrett Culver. Happy New Year's to you, Smoke You. A rookie card. Look at this. That looks like an old rookie. And a Larry Bird USA. So nothing crazy in that pack. That Larry Bird card's pretty cool, though. I don't like the super veterans that, you know, don't play anymore. They're not worth as much. But I think they're cool cards because those are a lot of the guys I grew up watching. Lots of hype around who, Kev? That's a good hit. This guy? Oh, I, I've never heard of him. Okay, I'll take your word for it. I watched that whole Lakers playoff run, too, and I don't remember seeing him. All right, here we go. LeBron was raving about him during... Oh, that's the guy. Horton Tucker. Oh, Taylor Horton Tucker. Okay, I got you. I did hear about that guy. There we go, Jimmy Buckets. One of my brother's favorite players. A Larry Nance Jr. for the Cavs. A Josh Richardson. Blue Reactive. An old school Amari Stoudemire. A DeAndre, Hun DeAndre Hunter rookie. Hall of Fame Scotty Pippen. And a Grant Williams rookie. Come on. We need that jaw. How much for that OG Raptors card? Which one was the OG Raptors card? Happy New Year to anyone who's not heard me say it so far. We're having fun just celebrating New Year's Eve, opening some sports cards, treating ourselves a little bit. We got a Kyle Anderson, a poor Zingus, a Victor Oladipo. I love this guy. First one in the pack. I don't remember which one that was. Oh, I had an NBA debut, Jarrett Culver. I didn't sleep up. I got to go back through these things and look at them. Victor Oladipo, a Carson Edwards uh, rookie. That's a pretty sweet looking card. A DeMar DeRozan Jam Masters. NBA debut, Cameron Johnson. Base rookie, Isaiah Roby. And a Julius Irving Hall of Fame card. I think it's in my junk pile. I don't really have a junk pile because I've never opened these before, so I plan on putting them all in my binder, my sports binder. These are my first mosaic basketball cards that I've ever opened. A lot of rookies, though. A lot of rookies. I'm excited for the football because we can get those pink, or the pink prisms in there. And I think those pink prisms look so good. All right, last pack.
All right, we got Aaron Gordon to start us off. Not a lot of duplicates either. Robert Covington. Yeah, it's a, it is a lot of packs for 50 bucks. Gary Harris. A Luke Kennard. A Kyrie Irving will to win. A Tremont Waters rookie card. NBA debut PJ Washington. That's a good card. A Darius Basley rookie card. Oh, that was... Wait, did I grab two there? No, that was it. I was one off. I thought there was one left. What? Oh, that's cool. All right, so I'd say nothing too crazy inside that box, but we didn't get a lot of duplicates, so that's fun. This whole stack here is good hits. I'm going to have to go back and sleeve up. I just don't want to waste time doing it on stream. So this is the stack of rookies, plus the thigh bowl, plus the Zion. These two are both good. That Zion for sure. Let me throw him in a top loader. Beauty. Love that LeBron too. Are you almost done? No, I'm not almost done. We've got this whole box of mosaic football. And we have all this. Should we open the mos Yeah. I'm not, are we opening all that on stream? That'll take forever. This is yours. Show them this one. Oh. We got this T. Higgins patch card that just showed up. Nick's a big Bengals fan. Who day? I got a little Jordan Love patch card. Little Here you go. Look at that. Antonio Gibson patch card. All right, so we're going to set these off to the side. Those are hits to sleeve. This was the quote-unquote junk pile per Kev. All right, here we go. We're cutting it. Cutting it, Nick. Uh-oh. All right. Drum roll. This is yours, Drew? No. No. I just been debating about buying one for 350 No, I'm not opening the Hidden Fates today. Football. You're talking about those ETBs? Oh, my. There's a, there's a lot of cards in here. Are there any big sports cards that you guys on? Uh, Kev, you collect sports cards? I need someone to tell me to buy this on StockX for three fifty. I don't. I don't know if there's anyone in here that knows market prices of sports cards very well. Yeah, I don't. Where is Mike? He's the one who said. Dirty Mike's with the boys. Dirty Mike and the boys. I think he's at. He said he was going shopping at Lululemon with other guys today. We did that online yesterday, yeah. two days ago. All right, so inside one of these big cello packs, look at this. You get two packs and then a bonus pack. Like a bonus Jonas. I've never opened football mosaic either. I just want to see. Oh, no, Kev's gone. All right, here we go. Oh, We're going to start bus. it off with the bus. $5. Vikings, Will Fuller, Notre Dame alum, Hall of Fame Troy Polamalu, an old school Barry Sanders, and a James Morgan rookie card. So wait, you get a rookie card in every one of these? Not necessarily. Is I, it seemed like in the other mosaic, the yeah. last card was a rookie card. The last, the last couple, depending on how many cards in the pack, the last one. Oh was yeah, you know what? When he opened the last night. Big packs. All right, we got a Bobby Wagner like and Alvin Kamara. Silver oh, a Joe, Joe Mixon. Mixon. He put him in the trash pile. <laughs> Good Tyreek Hill. Yep, there's a silver prism. A Mike Evans silver prism. A Chase Young NBA debut. Oh, Ohio State. And a kid reporter. You just throw those away or what? Uh, That's could, cool. We could win. Could I know a guy that want to use them. I would wait till last and open all your black packs at once. 
Well, are we gonna open? I don't know if I'm gonna open this whole box. Oh, all right. That's a lot. All right. Looking for. Oh. Not a Len Dawson. It's pink. An Aaron Donald. And a oh. Joe Burrow. Let's go. Hell yeah. Double bag it. That is a big hit. If you hand it back to me, I'll put them in the hard place. I got it. And if you hand it to me, I'll keep it. <laughs> First pack magic. Hey, Kenny. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. That's a sweet card. Kenny and I got good cards last night. So it, we're, looking, we're looking for Tua, Joe Burrow, and Herbert. Probably a base rookie is worth um, these, I'll tell you what, these pink prisms, though, are good hits because you, you, the only chance to get them is in these cellos. Very good, very good. Is it better than your other? No, that's not, that's not better than the other burrow. Even though your other burrow is crooked? Oh, no, the prism, prism sells more. Even sells if it's for not more than the a 10? Yeah. All right. You thought I, I was looking for LeBron in basketball. We're on to football. <laughs> What's he doing? All right, we got a Le'Veon Bell. What a promising career. Derwin James Jr. A Calvin Johnson. A Thurman Thomas. That's awesome. What is this? A flea flicker. Kamara, Drew Brees, Michael Thomas. Those are all three good. That's kind of a cool card. And a Hall of Fame Terry Bradshaw. But this one's not numbered. That's that's the regular. Like if they're, they'll do those oh, wait. in the green or the discos. You got two more packs. Oh yeah, my bad, my bad. I forget how much comes in these. There's a lot. Seems like a lot. Drew Drew Br Drew Brees. <laughs> Landon Collins. Uh, Larry Fitz. Stefan Gilmore. That's a the green looks really good with that blue. That's a good card. Yes, a Mahomes. It's a good card there. And a Jeff Akuda in wow. his Ohio State outfit. Salta Coop, $20. That's a good one. Jeff Akuda. Coop's gonna shovel the driveway. Next three times it snows. That's a good looking card outside of the fact that it's blue in the background. Bonus, Jonas. Here we go. J.J. Watt. Gronkowski. And an MVP, Tom Brady. Wearing, wearing the Patriots. That's a good one. Super Bowl this year, so the Tampa Bay jersey ones would be worth something. Someone has Unbroken Bonds, Blastoise, GX, PSA 10 for 65. That seems real good. Which ones? Which Blastoise is in... Unbroken Bond. Blastoise GX. I'm, I'm drawing a blank on that actual card. We're checking. Kenny's on it. Got our data guy on it. Unbroken Bonds. All right, now we're on to another pack. So which one? Oh, the Panini has the, the red, white, and blue. Yeah, uh, the Prism. These are Panini, but these are Panini Mosaic. So the Prism Cello packs that are back there have the red, white, and blue. Are you talking about the regular one? Yeah, just the regular Blastoise GX. What's it look like? Um, like this. Oh, really? Yeah. From Unbroken Bond? Yeah. That's a super weird looking card. Yeah, this is the one that you're... This is the one you're looking for. The secret rare one. Yeah, yeah okay. Hmm. There's free money. Anytime there's a secret rare one. Yeah, not the rainbow. I don't know about that one then. Jared Cook. Yannick Nagaku. Ngakwe. Ngakwe. 
Philip Lindsay, a little Leonard Fournette action. A got game Tom Brady. And on the back, an AJ Terrell. Clemson, boo, Clemson. Why are these dudes in their college jerseys? Those are the harder variations to get for a rookie card. Oh, the college ones are? Yeah. I didn't know that. I, got, I bought a. Um, I got a. Oh, Claypool. Cunningham. A Randall Cunningham. A Robert Woods. Devin Singletary. Hey, Boomer. Boomer Esiason. I bet you he's got a nice size forehead under that helmet. <laughs> Here comes a will to win. A will to win Aaron Rodgers. That's a cool looking card. Shredded. Tell me that's a decent one, Jeff. Yeah, Toilet cool. paper. An NFL debut Cam Akers. I know that's a good one. And a kid reporter. Or as Pat Beyond calls him, Cakers. Cakers, yeah. Did you tell them you were streaming, Stevie? Who? No, I didn't. Oh, yeah, I guess I should have told the sports card Discord guys that we were streaming sports cards. All right, come on. Kyle Fuller in his... Crazy Bears socks. A Mike Evans. And a Clyde wow. Edwards Hilaire rookie. That's a cool, that's a, that's a good one. That's a real good one. Double value. Yeah. 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 So I bought this box. This mosaic box was like 310 bucks. And now I think they're closer to 400 bucks, so they're going up in price. But I think there's a lot of value in these boxes. You got 12 packs with 15 cards per pack. That's a lot. I mean, you can see how – look at how fat those are. Are there any fabric ones, like jersey pieces in these? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I think. Do they do autograph ones? There's a Kirk Cousins for K Big Kenny. Uh, you like that? A Marshawn Lynch. A Kenny Galeri. Hey, Spirit Ninja, happy New Year. Have a great day. Thanks for stopping in, man. Dwayne Haskins. Another flea flicker. And a J.K. Dobbins base rookie. I got a couple of those. You got him in Prism. This is retail mosaic, right? Yeah. I'm not having to buy them all on stock decks. I'm just sitting on it sealed. I would wait. Because you got to pay tax and shipping. Michael Thomas. Until after the season. Chris Conley. Tredavious White. Carlos Hyde. There's an old Ohio State player. A got game Adrian Peterson. And an NFL debut, Jared Judy. That's another good one. There's nothing crazy. No, nothing. Yeah, the cello pack. I feel like the cello packs are just a lot of value. There's nothing insane in them. But you can get all your base rookies. The prism's the same. It's just a lot of value. All right, we've got a Calvin Ridley, pink mosaic. I think he's underrated. We've got a Brian Dawkins and a Jalen Hurts. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Bag him. I mean. I personally would sell Jalen Hurts. I don't think he's going to be that good. I think Hurts is better than Tua. I agree with that. I don't think either of them are I mean, you can't be Ridley. replaced by Ryan Fitzpatrick to win. <laughs> so you can win football yeah. games. Dude, we're getting a lot of cards here. 
Is this the last? No, we still got two more on this side. This box is enormous. Yeah, pink mosaic. Yeah, pink mosaic hurts is nice. I got a pink Joe Burrow too. I got a handful of hurts last night. I thought that was it. No. Jalen hurts. I got a handful of hurts. Yo, if anyone from the sports discords comes in here, say hi in the chat, will you? So we know where you're, you're here. I forgot I should have posted this to you guys earlier. I started off with Pokemon. How'd you get a Dwayne Haskins? I already got one. Yeah. Cut. I got a Dwayne Haskins. That's going to be a rare card. What is all over that one? Wow, look at the dent. Look at the dent on that card. I think it's not a burrow. What's up, little flip? Hey, we pulled a pink Joe Burrow. A DJ Moore. A Kareem Hunt. There we go. Coop. What, what colors do they have to be numbered? A will to win Drew Brees. Oh, yeah. And a base rookie Keyshawn Vaughn. We got a Mike, a Mike Williams, a Terry Bradshaw, a Mari Cooper. I haven't seen any Andy Dalton's pool. Michael Vick, Jeff. That's mine. I got game Adam Thielen. That's pretty sweet. I got a A Pro Bowl Calias Campbell. And that's it. Oh, we still got the bonus pack. All right, TJ Hawkinson. AJ Brown and a Troy Aikman Hall of Fame. That's pretty cool. I know, maybe the second pick. Oh, Jason Taylor's cool. Yeah. That's a sweet montage. All right, still looking for a base rookie. Joe Burrow. Oh, we got a silver. Josh Allen. Carson Wentz. Troy Aikman. Jerome Bettis, silver prism, Jeff. Nice. It's a good one. A Derrick Henry touchdown masters. And a... De Darrington Evans, rookie. All right, later, man. Thanks for hanging out. All right, that's halfway through that box. Oh, almost. We got two more packs. Hey, hold on. Before you open that, how much will you sell that for? The rest of that box? No, just that pack. No deal? DK Metcalf. And Devin McCourtney. Look at some of these come with dents on them. Like, look at that. <laughs> Ed Reed. Herman Moore. A Got Game Zeke. And a Steve Young Hall of Fame. Probably would have made the money. No, What's the chase guy. cards in NFL? So you're looking for rookie quarterbacks. So, like, we got a Jalen Hurts. We got a Joe Burrow. A Justin Herbert. Uh, Tua Tagliavola. You're looking for. You're basically looking for rookies. I'm not selling these. I'm not selling these to you, Nick. For Coop. All these cards are gonna be Coops one day. He's just gotta kill me, dude. Not bad at all. Yeah. So that's only we're halfway, Papillon, through the. We got the. Cello box. I'll go back through this stack, and you can tell me if any of these are any good. DJ Clark. Marshawn Lattimore, and an Antonio Gibson. That's a good card. Yeah, the 
Gibson's good. So let me sleeve up these. This is the rookie stack here that I didn't sleeve up so far. So Antonio Gibson. Oh, we also hit this um, Clyde Edwards Hilaire rookie in the pink prism. We did a basketball before and hit the Zion NBA debut. And we got a bunch of premium NBA hoops. Yeah, we got a lot of cards here. Yeah, you could, I'll, I'll stack them up and you can show. Bump the camera there. We got a Jerry Judy. We got a JK. We got a Cam Akers, Cakers. AJ Terrell. Jeff Akuda in the Ohio State uniform, which I love. I'm a big OSU fan. So that, that was a cool hit. NFL debut Chase Young, rookie. Another Ohio State guy, James Morgan. And then here's the, this is the, oh, also, check this out. We hit the MVP in his Patriots uniform, Tom Brady, pink mosaic. It's a pretty cool card. Jeff, I'm going to go back through these. Tell me if I should sleeve up any of these. I would sleeve up any of the variations. I sleeve up all mine. All right. So sleeve up this whole stack. Got Marshawn Lattimore pink. Yeah, if you want while you're sleeving up. Unless you want to sleeve them on camera, I'll open some of that stadium club. Yeah, you want to do that? All right, hold on. Let me throw my base over here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Actually, let me take this stack and this stack. I'm going to go off camera and sleeve these up. My brother's going to hop on stream here and open yeah. some stadium club. I need some hand action. Oh, yeah. Yeah, can, you, can, you, can you clap and say goodbye? Changing 500. Stevie's got to go through and pick which ones. I mean, all the, all the hangers are his of the NBA hoops. No, you got one hanger first. Oh, did I get one hanger? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll separate them. I'll I mean, all the all the cellos are here. I got these. <coughs> no, you no. Oh, that's right. I got a set. I got two of the NBA. All the prism cellos. This is yours. This is yours. And these are yours. Those are coops. No, Jeff's. Oh. All right. You want me to open the NBA hoops instead of the stadium club? Either that or that prism. The box. <laughs> Hoop. Give me the NBA hoops. This is my first Yeah. The whole thing. Just paint it off. Oh. Yeah. I'll take it off. Kenny's a D. Yeah. Take some clothes off. I mean, I'm doing two months now. But you got some good cards. Oh, okay. I mean, I made money for sure. All right. Bro, that, so we got. Man, that is fun. We got a lot of good cards. Two cellos of NBA hoops and a hanger. Well, the thing that's fun is that I haven't opened any of these, so everything is good to me because I've never, I don't have any of them. I like the way they set up these mini packs too, so you get a lot of things. I'm excited about them. Here's your piece. Yeah, Jeff's. That's all Jeff's. Do you have sleeves here? Yeah, that's mine. There's sleeves right beside you. Yeah, I saw them. Yeah, that, that pack was already busted open. Huh? All right. So we got Alex Caruso, Iguodala, Michael Kidd Gilchrist, Tobias Harris, Mello. One, 
Caldwell Pope, Pascal, Monk. Is that Pascal worth anything? Anthony Davis, Prism, Silver Prism. Schofield. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Schofield Prism. And Blake Griffin Courtside Prism. Oh, nice. RJ Barrett right on the back. Come on, Looney. Biombo. Gilgis Alexander. Middleton. De'Aaron Fox. Knox. Badatsi. Darius Garland. Julius Irving. Van Fleet, Mo Bamba, and we got game, R.J. Barrett. Draymond Green, Miles Bridges, Miles Turner, Justice Winslow, Thomas Bryant, Drew Holiday, Lonnie Walker, Paul George, Kyle Anderson, Bruno Fernando, Millsap, Keldon Johnson, John Stockton, Dwight Powell. Oh, there we go. Nikhil Alexander Walker, former Hokie. Terry Rozier. Eric Gordon. Chris Dunn. Landry Schmidt. And Cameron Johnson. All right, let's open the bonus packs. Crooks, Andrew Wiggins, Mariel Shayok. Goga, Kevin Herter, Hassan Whiteside. And Mike Scott. Not bad. Is that the whole box? That was the hanger and the two cellos. No Zion? No big hits? No Zion, no Morant, no Kobe White. Uh, what else should we do? Maybe the five little prism packs? Yeah, do, those, do your little prism packs. These guys? Yeah. I'm just gonna no. that thing. Huh? Let's, see, let's see what it is. First, it was gonna get stock either Monday or Tuesday this week. Alright. Will Fuller. There's Madaya. Ian Thomas. Chris Carson. Yep. <laughs> Nick, you can have that pack for $35. Ripping and tearing. Like, I mean, oh, I Curtis Samuel. Because, like, you know, you're going to walk yeah. down the road if you don't have one. Mm -hmm. Jamison Crowder. Oh, that's a good one. Van Jefferson. Jalen Ramsey. Curtis Samuel. At least he's a rookie. I feel like he's oversaturated. Who's that, Van Jefferson? 
No, Curtis Samuel. Oh. Eric Kendricks right on back. There's a Troy Palomalo. Jacob Beeson. That's a good one. DeAndre Hopkins. Eric Kendricks. What's up, Tony? Jarvis Landry. Lynn Bowden. DJ Moore, Jerry Rice. That's a cool. I I don't know that I'd seen that one yet. Did you buy these from the card shop? No, these all came from that kid. All right, Austin Hooper, DeAndre Swift. That's a good one. Barry Sanders. And Rondé Barber. Grab that burrow on show Tony. He's a Bengals fan. Stogie P opened that one. Is that Tony from Sinbin? Yeah. Oh, Tony's here? All right. Oh, you're looking at my cards in the back. You're right. Bro, look how many cards we got still. You ready to open more, Stevie? He's picking a Bengals jersey. <laughs> All right. What should we open? NBA hoop cello packs? Yeah. We just need two more people to, do, to get in for this thing. All right, let me pull some stacks out of here. I'm gonna go back to the mosaic football. I still, I'm not gonna stop till I hit a Herbert or I'm out of packs. <laughs> so if, if we hit a Herbert, I'm done. But hey, Stevie, throw me one of your packs of uh, slaves. All right. So if you just got here, we still got the rest of this mosaic to open. Can we get a clap? Oh, changing 500. I'm in. All right, so I got all that mosaic sleeved up. We did mosaic basketball, too. So big hits in the mosaic earlier. We hit the Jalen Hurts base rookie. We hit the Joe Burrow NFL debut. Clyde Edwards Hilaire. Um, we hit the Zion, in, Zion NBA debut in regular uh, basketball mosaic. We hit... This pink variation MVP Tom Brady in Patriots, which I think is a pretty cool hit. And then the rest of the rookies, James Morgan, Chase Young, Jeff Akuda. I'm a huge Ohio State fan, so this was a good hit for me. He's in his Ohio State jersey. I love that. A.J. Terrell, Cam Akers, J.K. Dobbins, Jerry Judy NFL debut, Keyshawn Vaughn, Darrington Evans, Antonio Gibson, pink, D.J. Clark Jr., pink, Marshawn Lattimore, Jerome Bettis, Troy Aikman, Will to win Aaron Rodgers, and then, I mean, I could go through the rest of the stack, but we've got a huge. This is all. These are all variations from that first stack of mosaic. I think these cello packs are a blast to open. They are a lot of value for the money. I mean, I paid three hundred and ten dollars for this entire sealed box delivered. Unbelievable. You know, Nick. Nick is going to want to buy single cards from me. Just the Bengals. He's going to want to buy the Bengals. All right, here we go. Curtis Martin. Jared Goff. Aaron Rodgers base. Oh! A dick butt kiss green. Best name That's ever. Awesome. That's a linebacker. A got game, Miles Sanders, and a KJ Hamler rookie. Is anybody still watching uh, Sports Fan? I don't know who's in here right now. Jimmy Garopp. Good looking dude. Kyle Rudolph. 
That guy's a beast. Christian McCaffrey. Darius Leonard. I got game Nick Chubb. I'm a big Browns fan here. That's a good hit for me. An MVP Aaron Rodgers. Another good hit. And a kid reporter. A Troy Aikman pink. A Joey Bosa. Another Ohio State. And a T. Higgins rookie pink. That's a nice one. Oh, I'm out of sleeves here. Double bag that one. That's nice right there. That's a good hit. Nick, you would have liked to have gotten that pack, huh? Uh, I don't know. We'd have to look it up. All right. How long? How long have you been live? An hour and a half. Jeff, do you want to stream anymore on cards, or should we just? I mean, I'll just open, hanging out. We've been streaming for an hour and a half already. I opened everything I was going to open. I think most of the people that were here from my group checked out. Probably just one or two. Well, I'm selling those hidden fate CTVs for 300 bucks a piece. Four. <laughs> hidden fate CTVs. Those are going. Those might sell on Saturday. I got the. I is, got the one prism box. Is anybody else still watching that wants to see sports cards be opened? All right. I think we're going to hop off then. Happy New Year to everyone who's watching and everyone who came. Thanks for joining the stream. We'll talk to you later. Peace. No, it does.